Hey guys, I'm on my way to go and get my x-ray for my tailbone, so yeah, I get to finally see what's wrong with me. Uh, since I have to leave the house, I'm going to go ahead and do this lipstick uh, review. This is the Max Factor in, um, how do I forget, in uh, 660. 660, you'll notice it. You just had to take my word for it because my camera sucks balls. Anyway, Max Factor 660, so let's do this. Starting off with the same red, uh, same Milani red lip liner. And now the lipstick, same normal wand. I just scraped off the big chunk just in case you didn't see that. So this is terrible coverage if you don't add a lot, maybe because of the age, because this is 10 years old or so, I'm going to give it two coats just because it's so old. When it was fresher, I don't remember having to put on two, but I also scraped off most of it and this applicator doesn't hold shit. I remember this being a lot better than this. I'm definitely thinking age has something to do with this. I'm sorry. So that's taken like four coats to cover. Four. It is a beautiful red though. It's very sticky. Very sticky. I just wore this not too long ago and it wasn't this bad. Maybe because I hadn't had some new and good lipsticks to compare it to. But, uh, yeah. This doesn't feel so great, after all. Um, it's real, real sticky. I know you guys are probably thinking, oh, it's because it's so old. God, you're stupid. Mm. Yeah, it's old, but you know what? I've always worn really old makeup. I don't tend to ever buy makeup because I can never afford it. So most of my makeup is well over five years old. I know you're supposed to throw it out within a couple of months, certain things, but you know, like this, this is voluminous. And uh, I bought this, God, I'd say at least five years ago. And I just put this on today. So I know it's unhealthy. I know you're not supposed to do it, but when you're limited, you're limited. And if it's between old makeup or no makeup, I'm sorry, but I'd rather wear old makeup. So this is already dry. So that's still good. Just goes on sticky. And the other one, I guess, is supposed to change the color. It's not for protectant. Um, the protectant ones come with like a white chapstick looking thing. That's not what this is. So this is already set. 
and we'll just go about the day and see how it goes and then I'll check back and let you guys know what's happening and where this rates. <laughs> All right. Uh, don't judge me for using old makeup, like I said. See you guys later. All right, it's at the end of my day. Dyeing my hair. <laughs> a bit messy there. Left it in until it was dry. Uh, so, lipstick has stayed on pretty well. I had an initial bit where it was coming off when I ate. Um, been eating and drinking all day today and it is stop shaking sorry I just ate again so I'm gurgling but it came off a little on the inside and that's about it so I'm going to do another half as I do gross. When I eat, um, I sometimes get, you know, because of my surgery, like I gurgle and then I get lots of like mucusy gunk. Sorry about that. So it's gone on all right. I can't really see the difference. There's not a whole lot of difference between colors. It's worked out pretty well, this one. This is still one of my tops. But, um, it is a bit sticky. I, again, I think it's just due to the age of the product. It's always like the staying power is about the same as it was. Uh, stickiness is far more, but it doesn't come off. Like this is the side I just put it on and it's already dry. It's already kiss proof. So this stuff will be a pain in the ass to get off. I remember it was really bad. Um, I'd say final rating would have to be Jeffree Star first. Uh, this one would probably be second because it's still, even after being close to 10 years old, <laughs> it still works. That's all I got. This almost would be number one, actually. It just doesn't budge at all. Stuff is really good. Really, really good. Uh, so, I don't know. This might be tied with Jeffree Star. This is either number one or number two. Jeffree Star is number one or number two. They're both really good. I think this actually has a bit better staying power. But I don't remember if the Jeffree Star came off the inside of my mouth or not. That'll be the only deciding factor there. Pretty Zombie Cosmetics is number three just because of the fact that they came off quite easily and never fully dried and Lime Crime is in fourth and last place. As we, surprise, surprise, all knew that was going to happen. So I hope that you enjoyed this review. I know my camera is not so great so you can't really see the photos very well but hopefully I did the best I could to show you how well it stayed on the color might not be all that vibrant, but you could always Google the colors yourself and see what it looks like. But the staying power here is what I was reviewing, and you don't really need a clear camera to see that. I did my very best. And this one... <laughs> it's awesome. I suggest you try it if you can get your hands on it. It's sad that the shade isn't a bit more vibrant red. But, you know, at least it works. Let's see if I can find it here next to my plate. I'll try on step two just so you guys can see the color. 
because it says, you know, step one and then there's step two on the other side. And like I said before, I don't use the step two usually because it changes the color. But I will zoom in. It has kind of a sweet smell too. Yeah, so I think it's more like a gloss that goes over it actually. So it looks like a sweet smelling gloss. Now, I actually think, come to think of it, this should be number one because of the staying power and the lasting, considering that this tube is 10 years old. Well, I bought it in 2008 and it's 2016 now, so close enough to 10 years. And it still works. It's still liquid. It still stays. Um, I think it deserves to be number one. This stuff doesn't really stay all that great. It's lip gloss that goes over it. I don't like lip gloss. But the kiss proof underneath, after you wipe the lip gloss off, the kiss proof stays really well. Mm. Let's see, my tissue from yesterday. This is my tissue. Let's see if I can get this stuff off. So that's some of the lipstick and the lip gloss. Even wiping it, I still have quite a bit on. It doesn't want to come off. It came off a little bit here. It's patchy now. This isn't going to come off. This is going to take um, coconut oil to get off. This isn't going to come off with anything else. So, yeah. Definitive last, last rating. This is number one. Just look at this lasting power. So, I'm sorry. Jeffree Star, Max Factor has got to be number one. This is number one. Jeffree Star is number two. Pretty Zombies number three. And lastly is Lime Crime. So, I'll see you guys next thing. Sorry, I don't have anything else to review. But uh, if I ever get anything, I'll make some more. Hopefully one day I can get a better camera and it'll be nice and clear. And I'll see you guys next time.